All right, so this is my in the bag number two, the second disc. I'm gonna do a video for every single disc in my bag, but it is the stall from Castoplast. Um, I'm doing tour series discs for all of these because these are the discs that hand picked after scouring the earth for the best discs for every shot. And the stall is an overstable fairway driver. I mean, it's an absolutely critical disc. You have to have a controllable fairway driver. You have to have an overstable one. I mean, in a disc with a low turn and a higher fade. I am gonna be throwing several different fairway drivers that are overstable because they have distinctly different characteristics. And the reason I'm throwing the stall is it is the, it's the fairway driver that I could put the brakes on. I, I've made a video, I'll, I'll link to it somewhere on here, about throwing the slowest disc for the hole because that creates, I always get it wrong, largest margin for error. It's, it's the easiest to get right. Uh, you, you don't want a disc that sails if you're just trying to control it. Uh, Anders told me that this disc, when it was first released, wasn't too popular. And I understand why. Because aesthetically, you throw this disc, it flies, and then right when you think it's gonna be penetrating at the end of its flight, it kind of just goes bleh and drops. It's not aesthetically pleasing. It doesn't give you the distance. That's not a bad thing. You want to be able to throw a disc where you can control the distance. When you throw a disc with a higher glide, which is an essential disc, because you know you need more distance sometimes, but if a disc has a high glide, the trade-off for more distance is more unpredictability. So if you can reach a shot with a disc that doesn't glide, that's what you want. That's what the stall does. So right here, and I'm throwing pretty heavy winds right now. I, was, I think I was like 270 feet out, not a real far throw. But if you take a look, I just threw 50 shots in the wind that direction. And like none of them are more than 10 feet short and only a couple of them are more than 15 feet long. Um, I was right and left because it was windy. It's very unpredictable. I wasn't getting the angle right every time, but even when I made mistakes, the distance was predictable. And that's what the stall is for. Uh, I have a whole bunch of discs in my bag that I like because they don't fly. And I also have, will have discs in my bag because they do fly. Totally different discs for different shots. But uh, the stall from Castoplast Tour Series, uh, oh, I almost didn't announce it last time. Uh, January 11th, available. Go to scottstokely.net. This disc is going to drop. The Berg uh, just about sold out the first day. I think the stall is going to also. But uh, yeah, this is the second disc in my bag and there'll be uh, a number of future videos coming. Thanks guys. Wow.